well, controller. You, you mentioned the revenue estimate. Let me go go back yeah. there. You know, we we missed. The, I, mean, I understand. You know, it's not her responsibility. The process in place well, was. It, it, it's the process whoever's in that position, been. it is your responsibility to get the number right. Right. Well, she it is she, regardless you know, of the two years and nine months out. She, what she missed by more than eight billion dollars. Mm -hmm. It's not a rounding error. And no. the fact is, I've had a lot of people sit up here over the last couple of years who said, if we knew back then what we knew two years out, we would not have made a lot of very difficult decisions in that 2011 session. I had a chairman of finance, Mr. Williams, chairman of appropriations on the House side, Mr. Pitt said to me, if we had known what the revenue was accurately two correct. years prior, we wouldn't have cut public education to the degree that we did. Well, you had a lot of people tell you that if we had accurate information, the world would be different. I, I can tell you, as a member of the legislature, the 2011 session was a very miserable time. It was a rough time. It was a very rough time sure. dealing with the budget and the finances. And so therefore, absolutely. Wouldn't you have preferred we, to have an accurate we, number? Of course, as a member of the Senate Finance, I want an accurate number. And I think that it's important that as you see numbers changing, yeah. one, you tell the public. Number one, we have to take that agency in that particular area, revenue estimating, and we have to look at the models that they use, because those of you that may not know, we use economic modeling. Yeah. And then we try to tweak that modeling to adjust it to Texas. And Texas right now is doing very well economically compared to the other right. states. So we have to do a lot of tweaking is my point. We have a lot of different industries that are coming to Texas that have not been here today and have not, have not been here in the last decade. And we have to focus on those. We have to in particularly focus on the oil and gas side of it because that has changed everything So that's how you avoid a repeat of what we saw Well, I think that, that by paying very specific attention to make sure that your folks are getting trained right. to the level that they need to be, that there's cross-training with, with other folks do revenue estimating in states. Did you know that there's like a revenue estimating conference every year? Right. We hardly send anybody to it. And, and I don't think going to conferences solves everything, but my point is, is you understand what are trends and issues, and that is very important. But as the controller, you have to make sure that you're asking every single t couple of months, six months, what are the numbers, what are we at today, and if you see the things changing, yes, the legislature has already left, but good, bad, or indifferent, you don't come back around, same as back in 2003 when I first got in the legislative session. I won my Republican runoff in April, and I remember back then, I remember like it was yesterday, that we were told that revenues were going to be flat for the 03 session in 02. And then bar, come where, probably around, I don't remember exactly, October, no, sorry, it's not zero, it's not flat, it's a $5 billion hole. Wow. Then we got into session, boom, January, nope, number changed again, it's $10 billion. Right. But it's better to have that information than not. Uh, yes, but right. it'd be better to have the information and not, one, have, if you see a trend line coming, you need to be much more ahead of so it. So your commitment then, if you win this office, is to be much more in regular communication with Correct. the legislature as these things change. And to make sure right. that we completely reevaluate how we do the revenue <laughs> estimating in that, in that division, right. to make sure that the tools, the equipment that the staff has, that we're paying the attention to it. Because, right. you know, if we have, say, $6 billion revenue estimating, number that's off. Six billion is a lot of money. Yeah. I can't even begin to imagine not as, six not billion as much as eight dollars. Billion. Not as much as eight billion. Right. But what is that in comparison to the overall budget for two years? Yeah. Well, three I, and five percent, but three and five percent when you're dealing with that amount of money and you're dealing with public education and higher well, education, huge. those are very real issues. Whether you're dealing with criminal justice and whether we make sure that we have drug drug diversion programs or other programs, when you cut those, then we then programs that are working, we need to make sure that we focus on them and don't have higher costs for taxpayers later. Yeah. I need to press you on what you said earlier. You know, well, this is the process. We, we know it's every two years and you know, mm -hmm. we're not going to bring the session back in, in the even number of years to relook at it. Why not? That's this is the 12th or 13th largest economy in the world. Mm -hmm. And you, as you acknowledge, you would not run your business. I would not run my business. Nobody in this room would run their business predicting two years out what the situation is going to be. Why not look at doing some kind of a midpoint? Well, you, you can you can ask uh, the next governor that question. I'd love or, to have or, a or either we'll uh, we'll have a constitutional amendment. I mean, the fact you, is, you is would not that be for some kind of re I, I revision do. of that process. If there is a, obviously if there is a significant number difference and the governor wants to call us back in the legislative session to address it, same as we've been in for school finance right. or other <laughs> issues, but I do not think in any right. shape, form, or fashion that we need to be a state that comes in every legislative session every two years, every single year.